Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to part two of today's stream. We are doing some more of our Final Fantasy X to Fiend Tales run. Okay, it's going really well. We beat up Trema, yes. Okay, we love that for us. And um, now we're just trying to get a large trap pod so we can catch this last fiend um, before we do the ending stuff of this run. Okay, so yeah, that that's what's up. That's what's up. All right. <coughs> um, ba -ba 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 -ba, yeah. Okay. Um, we are gonna do. We're gonna do the Youth League thing again. The Youth League Cup. Trying to get Gipple into our into our thing. Yesterday I was at the stables for my riding lesson. They have a cat who keeps the mice out of the cafe. Oh, yesterday she kept begging for attention, so I gave her scritches and she flopped over and demanded that I give her belly rubs. <gasps> While she had her claws out, she was trying to grab my sleeve. No, thank you, kitty. I recognize a trap when I see it. Koneko, the cake, I love you. Oh, oh my god, that is so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my god. Okay. Ugh. How do you not like cuddle the kitty more? Oh my god. Alright, Ronso Hardliners. Who the fuck is that? Probably two two Ronsos? Oh, three Ronsos. Oh, it's oh it's this guy. Okay. What what was his name? Garrick. Yeah, it's Garrick. Garrick and the Ronso Youth. Okay, we actually need to beat up the Ronso Youth first. Okay, Riku, dispel that shit. Um, yeah, dispel tonic. Oh, oh. Whatever, we'll dispel Garrick. Here goes. Jana. Hopefully just one Catlin gun kills it. This kitty loves everyone, oh my god. Sometimes she finds a person to trap and just sits on their lap. Congrats, you're now held captive. I love kitties that love everybody. That's the best. She once fell asleep on my dad's lap. Okay, but how how has someone not taken that cat home and like just been so enamored? Like how, how? Is that a problem for them? I feel like that would be a problem for the stable. If this cat loves everybody, that like people would just take the cat home. Because <clears throat> I feel like that's, that's a thing. Like, because we have a cat that loves everybody. We have Queen. And um, people definitely try to take clean home when they come over. It's a known thing. This cat refuses to let anyone pick her up. Oh, okay. This cat will not be carried, I understand. Oh, he has fireworks too. All right, we got this. We got this. We need to get Gipple. I mean, if we don't, we can't. We did collect all the Crimson Spears, so we can go down to the Den of Woe and fight Gipple there. But it would be way easier if we could do it inside the Fiend Arena. But I did do that just in case, you know. This is the part where you get hurt. All right, Garrick's got to be almost done. There's another gorgeous orange tabby, and he doesn't like humans, so he has to be try to touch him. And he once whacked me with his paw when I tried to let him sniff my hand. Oh my god, you were like, "Do you want sniffs?" And he was like, "Boom!" <laughs> I could see it. I could see it. He was like, "No, why would I do that?" Oh my god, this is not the pod I want. Lulu. We fight Lulu? Oh. Oh, Gipple's not even in this split. Whatever. <clears throat> we might have to go down to the Den of Woe and do it that way. Oh, she has Reflect. My Moogle Beam and Catling Gun aren't affected by Reflect, are they? Oh my god, she can do her overdrive and it's called T-Fire? What does the T stand for? Turbo fire, maybe? Um, 
Yeah, I guess it's gotta be Turbo. So at least Moogle Beam and, uh, and Catlin Gun don't seem to be affected by Reflect. Freeze! I'd rather not. Um, let's make a potion. In case she's about to bust out some kind of ridiculous version of Ultima. T Ultima. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's also a third kitty, a gray or brown tabby, but we rarely ever see it. On rare occasions, it's spotted. That it's spotted, it's always carrying a mouse. Oh, so it only loves one thing eat mouse. Oh my god, these are not the trap pots I want! Okay, and it's Nuge again. All right, bitch. Let's get this. Pray later. Pray later? I pray now. I pray now. I need to be praying to RN Jesus to give me what I want. A trap pod L. RN Jesus, I'm, I've been through a lot. I think, um, and I pray to you all the time. You know, you are the light, you are the love, you are the loot. Um, I, and I do think I should get a Trap Pod L from Nuge here. I think that would be really good. That Mega Potion was not enough. We need better. Oh my gosh. Okay, we have Mega Elixir, right? Yes. Just don't pick on Riku, Nuge. Don't pick on Riku with whatever your next attack is. Do you like the Far Plane thingy Madu on, like, Yuna or something? That would be better. Oh, I keep forgetting to put the Iron Duke on Riku. Oh, well, it's okay to do it on Pain, too. That's fine. There we go, Mega Elixir. Okay. Fabulous. Back in business. This puppet show's over. It's not a puppet show. Are you calling my mascots puppets? They are costumes. Okay, they are not puppets. This is not a Muppet situation. They're costumes, mascot costumes. Very different. You're mine. Let me end your pain. My god, Nuge. This is just ridiculous. Pain holds a puppet in her hand. Does she? Her cactuar is not a puppet, is it? I have to see how she holds it. No, it's just a plushie. They all are just holding plushies. No, Riku's isn't a puppet either. He's a plushie. Right? Am I crazy? Oh my god, that's not what I need. Okay. Well, let's do that again. I guess until I get a trap pot L, or until we, um, till we get Gipple, whichever comes first. Weak squad. Oh, Gipple, again, Gipple's not even in this. Well, whatever, I still need a trap pot L, so it's fine. Oh my gosh, it's these guys. Friends, I remember you. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, they love their plushies. They had a move called Mythbuster. What the heck? Okay, but these fiend tails were the best. The the goons fiend tails. Oh my god, so much love. They were they were amazing. This is the part where you get hurt. I loved them. And then they became like the goon rangers.
finally. Thank you. Thank you. I knew the, the goons are the best. Yes. Okay. Lucille next? All right. I'm gonna miss you. What does non Periel do? non is like those little, um, those little, uh, candies. Like snow caps, right? Splendid. Sorry, Lucille. Had to do it. Don't need that. You again. We got this. <coughs> Death is happiness. <clears throat> Stupid light ball. This move is so dumb. Why do they let him do this? a mega elixir even though he hasn't done any more attacks yet i know he's going to and i'm gonna need it yeah i knew it back up You got those girls. You've beaten them up so many other times. This time is no different. There's that chain. I don't know why the chain wasn't going off on Trema, but it's going off now, like when I'm fighting these. Okay, sweet. We got our large. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay. No, we don't need that. So we got our large, um, so we can go trap Paragon. Let's do it, let's do it. We got everybody else, we gotta get him. Oh, not tournament, <laughs> just kidding. There we go, let's return, okay. Trap Creature. And we're gonna go to Bavel and we're gonna use our large pod. Okay. There he is! Okay, the last one! Alright, now we got to level him. Hey, Paragon! Alright, so let's give him um, his double experience. There we go mascot and then you can have um key to success and then there's a black lore there's one okay so we can have flare too okay and he's level 64 so he needs to get to 69 giggity
And then I am going to need more trap pods, so I guess... You know what? I bet he could beat up the Youth League. Let's see if he can do it. Let's see if he can beat up the Youth League. I believe in you, Paragon. I believe in you. Here we go. The Gullwing guys. Oh my god, is it going to be Buddy and Brother? Oh my god, it's Buddy and Brother! <laughs> oh my god. Paragon, you got this. I trust you. Let's see if he can do it with the AI, you know. Oh my, right? Koneko, I was not expecting them in here. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. Like, what the heck? Oh my god, he's actually not doing well. I guess because I can't, like, I can't control him. So this is kind of like other ones before, like, without being able to control them, it's, like, really challenging. Okay, well, I guess he can't beat Youth League. <clears throat> No. We'll just we'll pick up special spheres, I guess. Okay, well that didn't work out. <laughs> uh let's do let's do maybe he can do Grand Cup hard. And then he can beat up Tom Berry the Ripper. Let's find out. Okay. You can do this, Paragon. You can do it. You're basically my last fiend. I mean, there are some more. Okay, we're not quite done, but they're not, it's not the same. And I'm not really 100% sure how it exactly works for the others. Okay, he got that, he got that, he got that. All right. Uh, no, I don't think so. I think just specials is the only ones that they might make us use. Oh, here we go, Tom Berry the Ripper. Can he do it? Can he do it? He cannot do it. Look at that. The amount of damage. Yeah. Nope. He cannot do it. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. You tried, my friend. You tried. Okay. Well, let's just level him. Alright. Let's battle simulator and uh, go down to hell breeders. Yes. Okay, he just needs to get to level 69. And he already got one from just the messing around we just did. Yeah, he's gonna kill Hellbreeders, no problem, of course. Gosh, he probably needs lots to level up, though. <clears throat> we get from doing the Fiend World Cup and finishing kind of that little story that we started there with unlocking that with Shinra. So we'll have to go through more of those. on the Fiend World Cup. So basically it says get the Dolomin and release it. We've done that. Get the Monolith and release it. Um, get Ultima Weapon and release it. And then we get the Fiend Deathmatch mission which unlocks the Fiend Portal. So that's the step that we're on. Then we have to go to the finals and beat the Fiend Portal. So that's the, the next step that we haven't done quite yet. So that's what we'll try to do after we level up Paracon. We'll try to go beat the Fiend Portal.
That supernova move, we need to get that for our blue bullet. That's another blue bullet we can get. Ultima Weapon also does that. Ultima, you can find Ultima Weapon in the Chocobo dungeon, so we might have to go down there. It's kind of like with Gipple, where I, I, I feel like he's going to unlock in the paint arena, and I'll be able to get him here instead of having to go to his actual location, but we'll see. I'm not really sure what's going to happen with that. All right, two more levels. <clears throat> I know I can get the Cry in the Night. So we've got basically three blue bullets left to get. Supernova, Mortar, and Cry in the Night. Thank you so much for the alert, Koneko. Man, I cannot wait to see what Paragon's Fiend Tail is. Oh my god, this is going to be ridiculous. Like, what Like what could they do? What could they do that would like match the majesty? <laughs> Of Paragon, you know? The almost final boss of the game. Well, almost final optional boss of the game. Because he basically is, because you have to fight him before Trema, you know? So, like, what could his fiend tail be? So far, the final boss fiend tails have been a bit silly. So, I don't know what I'm expecting for this. But I, but I have high expectations. There have just been so many good ones. Like, this one will have to be one of those. Alright, one more level. And he does need several battles to level. I don't know if that's because he's so high level now, or because, like, he just needs more because he's special, which might be the case. It's not uncommon for, like, the stronger, you know, enemies in a game or stronger whatever in a game, you have to spend more to level them. <clears throat> Alright, again, again, again! Oh my gosh, we're almost there. We're almost there, guys. Get him, Paragon! He thinks his Oversoul is going to do something, but you know better. Yes, you do. You're going to get him. I mean, it took two Supernovas. It took two Supernovas, but we got him. <clears throat> zoom, zoom. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> okay, we can do it. Okay, let's go back. Creature history! Alright, Paragon. Alright, creature analysis failed. This fiend lives to fight. Wait, you don't? There's no fiend tail for Paragon? What? What? Okay, there isn't one. All right, release. I was excited for that. I feel super scammed, Brain. I feel super scammed. What the heck? That was unfair. I don't like that. Okay, well, anyways, we did it. Um, Organized team. Let's put the girls back. Okay, and then... I just want to show where we are at. So if you go into the bestiary here, you can see all the previous fiend tales. So you should be able to see like that we are full up. So like we've done all these. So 
So here's one that we don't have. We're going to get that in a minute. And here's one we don't have. Two, three, four, five. Okay? So we're going to get those. And you see a lot of those are humans. But, um, but one of them actually isn't. Okay? So here we go. Back to the Fiend Arena. And we're going to do the Fiend World Cup. Okay? So we've beaten all these. We're going to go do the Fiend Portal. Yes. Can we do it? Oh, I forgot to save. Can I back out? If I die, am I going to die for real? I don't think I would because it's not a thing in the in the arenas. And I guess I could just like load from... Okay, why don't we do this? Why don't we do this? Uh, yeah, this will be okay if I close and reopen. Because I'm scared now. Hey, wait, let me just Google it before I get too scared. Um... When you die in Fiend Portal, do you die? Uh, Final Fantasy X 2. Okay, yeah, none of the Fiend Arenas result in a game over. Okay, we're, we're okay, we're okay. It's not going to result in a game over if we die. Well, don't mess with me, brain. Google says I'm not, I'm not going to. Google says I'm not going to die. Yeah. I don't know. Google lies? Google lies? Okay. Okay, whatever. Fine, we're gonna we're gonna go from my um my last save. It is a cool ending cutscene. Oh, so maybe I should die. Maybe I should save right before and then die. So we can see the cutscene. Is it like a bad ending? Okay, is my Yeah, what's this autosave? Okay, yeah, that's when I was looking here. Yes. Yeah, okay. Let me save. Save for realsies. I'm not gonna try to lose though. Like if we if we win, then we'll I'll Google the cutscene. Okay. Alright, here we go. Okay, girls are there. Um, oh wait. I wanted to put an Iron Duke on Riku. Now that we have three. Okay, so they're all equipped with Iron Duke and Invincibles. Okay. Here we go. Oh, of course. Look who's first. Wow. <laughs> Our best friend, Tonberry the Ripper. Hey, sir. How's it going? Wow. Never, uh, never thought I'd see you here. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay, where's my stamina tonics? Uh, there we go. I hear your meow meows, lady. I fight in a big old Tomberry, though. So, just give me a second, and then I can pet you.
Oh. Oh, I didn't need to do all that. I was being That's too extra. It? I guess I just do that much damage. Uh, no, we don't need that. We'll take specials. Okay, well, who's next? Curse Lifter. Okay. I'm feeling pretty strong that I beat Tom Berry the Ripper that fast. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, wait. I just noticed something. My, I didn't heal. I didn't automatically heal afterwards. What the heck is that? Okay. Brain, I see this is different. I misunderstood, but I see that this is different. This'll okay. do it. Too easy. Don't say that. This I feel like this cup is gonna get me with something awful. Okay. Um next we are fighting. Fiend World Cleric? Three of these guys, okay. Well, I just killed these with a straight up attack a second ago. So we're just gonna try to bump them. Just boop, just boop them with our little plushies. There we go. Just boop. Okay, next is Omega Weapon. Holy shit. Okay. Um, we're fighting Omega Weapon again. Alright. Alright. Got it. Oh, thank you for giving me that preemptive strike. Tom Berry the Ripper is definitely tougher than Omega Weapon, so... Yeah. Our plane cup is now being held in the arena. Okay. Ooh, cutscene. Mission complete. Traitor of the Fiend World Ultima Weapon. King of the Fiend World Omega Weapon. The two are siblings. Siblings who are fated to never coexist in the same world. That was what began this tragedy. Born as kings of the fiend world, the brothers must fight until only one stands. Ultima Weapon avoided this confrontation and fled to Spira. The fiends in pursuit sought to destroy Spira along with it. To protect Spira, Ultima Weapon sealed the path to the fiend world, cutting himself off from his home. Currently, it's in the interest of both siblings to seal the path to the fiend world once again. We'll keep one of the siblings in Spira. Okay, apparently I'm supposed to pick Omega Weapon. Okay, so we're gonna pick Omega. Allow into the Gull Wings, yes. Okay. Yeah, I didn't die. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a disappointment. Okay, what is, let's, let me see if I can find that cutscene. Um, Fiend Portal Failure Cutscene. Mm. Yeah, I don't see that anybody's, like, done the cutscene. Well, we have a save right before. We have a save right before it. We could go and, like, watch it. Yeah, let me make a new save. Because I didn't see it available on YouTube, so let's just go and let Tom Berry the Ripper wreck us. 
Okay, yes, new save data. Okay, now let's load 33. Because I want to see this. Like, I want to see all the endings. I'm not sure if Omega needs to kill you. But we're going to find out. We're going to find out. Okay, let's load 33. Okay, first of all, let's make everybody weak so that this is simple. Um, yeah. So let's give them shitty... Okay. No, we'll make everybody songstresses. They'll dance for their death. Okay, now they don't have much HP or anything. Alright. Let's die. Nuge would approve. Alright, here we go. Eternal prison. I don't know, we'll find out who that is. Alright. Get me. Oh. I guess I should have taken off some of the items. This isn't gonna this isn't gonna work. I should have taken off. Oh no. Oh no. And I can't kill him now because they're all songstresses. <laughs> I never thought dying would be such a challenge. Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh, I should have just escaped. Yeah, yeah, I should have just escaped. Hang on, though. Here we go. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. I want to see the bad ending. Okay, we're going to load 33. Okay. Equip. All right. We're going to do the shittiest um, garment grid with songstress, and we're going to... Take our accessories off. Okay. Same thing here. Oh. That's the wrong button. Okay. Okay, let's try that again. Can he kill me this time? I've literally, you know, do completely removed like all my advantage. All I have to my advantage is levels. Uh, I should die, no problem. Uh, okay, enter tournament. Bean portal. Yes. All right, take me away, Elephant Eater. I would not like to be part of this world. Oh, it's Humbaba. Get me, Humbaba. Get me, get me. I know you have attacks that can that can kill me. Oh man, even he doesn't kill me in one hit. I guess those levels make a big difference. Okay, but at least he's actually doing decent damage compared to my HP. Does Payne's outfit look like Elvis to anyone else? Payne literally looks like she's doing some kind of like Final Fantasy version of an Elvis cosplay. Come on, Humbaba. I'm like served up to you on a silver platter. Just take me. Yeah, she does, right? Like she looks like Final Fantasy Elvis. Okay, almost got him. 
All right, just whack Yuna now so we can see this cutscene. Goodbye, cruel world. What the fuck? <laughs> the Celsius blows up? That's what happens if you fail the fiend portal? The Celsius just explodes? Clap at the ending. <laughs> okay. I thought we had seen all the endings of this game. I was wrong. That was ridiculous. <laughs> I did not expect. Um, wow. <laughs> Oh my god! What? <laughs> what? Oh, okay. Okay. Alright. Cool. Um, anyways. Now we're supposed to level up and release Omega Weapon. So, let's, uh, let's do that. Alright. Come on, Omega. All right, we need you to double up. So you're gonna do Covenant of Growth. You're gonna do Moogle. Eminem, hello! How are you, friend? Um, we need to do Keys uh, to Success. And then we need to do, give him a um, Black Floor. Yes. Yes, yes, and he's 65, so he needs to get to level 70. All right, um, yeah, battle simulator. Meow, meow. <laughs> you have a hangover? I'm so sorry, my friend. Did you get your, do you have yourself some ibuprofen and some caffeine? Those are good for hangover. And some water, and make sure you're, make sure you're drinking lots of water. My cousin turned 40 yesterday. Oh my gosh, happy birthday to your cousin. Big four, oh. Nice. Happy 40 years around the sun. We love that. And you should be hungover for a 40th. That's appropriate. Means y'all had a good time. Fuck water. <laughs> That's how you got the hangover in the first place, Eminem. You gotta drink more water when you're drinking. Then you won't have so much, um, then you won't have so much hangover. We gotta get him to 70. I have coke and beer. Oh, you're doing the hair of the dog method? <laughs> if I have a hangover, I'll just drink more. And then the hangover will go away because I'll be back to being tipsy. I mean, it does work sometimes. But uh, I, don't, I don't recommend it because you're just delaying the hangover. Omega, why aren't you doing anything? Why? Why? It's the bar is full. The bar is full, and it's just chilling. Omega. Oh, Omega. Um. Omega. Oh, there it goes. There it goes. I just had to poke it. Is there somebody that gives better that he can kill? Let's see. Hellbreeders is five stars. 
Oh no. I guess we'll keep going with health readers, it's fine. You should try playing Power World. Eminem, we talked about this. I have played Power World, I played lots of Power World. But I can't stream it because it gives me simulation sickness. Like a lot of those um Unreal Engine games. They make your character too big, too close to the screen, and they put them off to the side. And uh, that configuration just totally triggers my simulation sickness. Um, if they would let me zoom out more, you know, if the if the camera was closer to how it is when you're like flying in that game, I wouldn't have a problem. But yeah, because of that, I can't stream it. Because I have to play in windowed mode, and I have to make it small. Um, so that I don't get sick. So, I can't stream it. It wouldn't work. But yeah, Power World's good as fuck. I love it. Yeah. It's a shame. But they just don't take that stuff into consideration when they're making games a lot of times. Like, they just don't think about it. And I know, like, why they make the character off-center is because they know it's too big on the screen, you can't see it in front of you. If your character's so big that you can't see in front of you when you center it, then the character's too big and you need to zoom out. You know what I mean? But they don't. They don't do that. Instead, they just make us suffer. The same thing happened with, um, Palea. You remember that game? When Palea first released, like, it was triggering the simulation sickness. They made a bunch of changes to it and some, added some settings that did help. But, um, the fundamental problem is that the character is too large and it's off to the side. Which is why I don't have any problem with, like, MMOs, because they're never like that. Their character's always in the middle, you know, in an MMO. And they're much farther back. But in these Unreal Engine games, it's like that. Like, in a lot of them. But Eminem, I will tell you something that I think would make you happy. Um, how close are we? Hang on. Let me just check this. How close are we? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, when we hit 500, I know what we're going to do for our 500 follower stream. And we're at 493 right now. So anyways, if you're enjoying the stream and you haven't clicked follow, click follow. Because at 500, I think I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do Sims and Slime. So we're going to play some more of our legacy. I'm going to do like a 12 hour. Like when we hit 500, I'll pick the date for it and we'll plan it. We'll do a 12 hour um, of our Sims legacy that we haven't played in forever. And, uh, and we'll make some slime. So, you know, some throwbacks. Some throwbacks to some of the OG content. And I'll make it like a 12 hour or something. We'll do like an all day stream. It'll be really fabulous. And that'll be what we do for 500. Cause I know, I know you miss the Sims on this channel. And that supernova just takes them out. Just done. Okay, we're at 68. We get two more levels. This whole time I've been chit-chatting away, and I didn't have it on times four. What's wrong with me? 
Anyway, it's on times four now. We're gonna go fast. Speed, speed. Zoom, zoom. I wasn't even paying attention. I was just like watching the supernova over and over. It's so beautiful. It's so radiant. Uh, the supernova that goes off. I love it. We have been 70 by now. That's okay. We'll be 70 soon. Where'd Lady go? She's not in here anymore. She's, she was over me. If I didn't give her pets right then, she doesn't want any. If she didn't really, really hang out. She just wanted attentions. I'll give her some attentions after her stream if she doesn't come back in here. I think what she really wanted was like drive-by attentions because she was hungry. Because she only meowed once and then she went to the food bowl, so. Oh, Queen's at the food bowl now. Do your cats ever do like, so some of my cats do like this weird thing where they take a mouthful of food and then they like put it on the floor next to the food bowl, like on the carpet, and then they eat it off the carpet. Why? So strange. Why would you want to eat off of carpet? You would end up getting like fibers in your mouth when you eat the food. It doesn't make any sense. But I've seen some of my cats do this. Like Queen is doing it right now. I do not get it. Okay, are we level 70? No, almost. One or two more battles, it looks like. And I just think if you eat, eat your kibble off the carpet, it's gonna get little little carpet bits in it. Like, I mean, it's the carpet's vacuumed, but like, it's still, you know, it gets cat, cat hair back on it instantly. We we'll only vacuum it once a week. So like, even though it was vacuumed on Friday, it's probably already got like fur and fibers and things already in it. And even when you vacuum carpet, like it doesn't fully clean it. It's very hard to fully clean carpet. Like almost impossible, so I don't get it. Why do you do that? Do you like to answer? I don't know if she wants to answer. She's behind me now. What? You want some pets? There we go. Okay, we're level 70. All right, so now we need to release him and that's supposed to unlock another step. All right, Omega. Oh, okay. Analysis failed. Fiend has no life readings. Shinra analysis. Omega weapon, the king of the fiend world. His soul is shrouded in darkness. I can't see anything. Analysis failed. Fiend has no life readings. Shinra analysis. So much hate swirling around in there. It has to be expunged or else. Oh God. Small folk of Spira, see the darkness that shrouds the fiend world. The almighty fiend king has fallen. Now both the fiend world and Spira will enter a time of chaos. It's all thanks to me. Learned a whole lot about fiends too. But I'm still only a kid. I still lack experience. I've come up with the ultimate research method to learn more about fiends. What is he doing? That's a model I've never seen. 
I'll become the almighty fiend king? Shinra, no! What? Almighty Shinra Cup. Almighty Shinra has entered the themed arena. Defeat Almighty Shinra and bring back the real Shinra? Oh my god. Oh my god, there's another cup. There's another cup. Um, no, I don't need that. Oh um, what the- what the- what the heck in heck? What? Oh my god. Okay. What have we got now? Uh, well, I need to put the girls back on the team. Okay. Um, Riku. Pain. Holy crap. Almighty Shinra Cup. It says... Oh, the Fiend Cup turned into Almighty Shinra Cup. Oh, okay. Well, let's do the Far Plane Cup first since we already had that unlocked. And then we'll come back and do the Almighty Shinra Cup. Okay, here we go. It says I'll see some familiar faces. So I'm, I'm ready. Show me some familiar faces. Okay, Shady Duo, fuck you. You're, you're, no, I don't like you. I know you're a familiar face, but I don't like it. This is not a face for me. Oh god. Oh god, we're speedy. Oh my god. I, I forgot I was still on times four. I was trying to control the girls on times four. Okay. It's mega potion up. Oh, and mush- Oh yeah, that's right. Mushroom Cloud is freaking- Ugh, I remember. I ran away. I ran away from the Mushroom Cloud. And he was, uh, oversold. Pernicious Powder shouldn't do anything with my ribbon. Yeah, it should all miss. Okay. Okay, we're onto the Mushroom Cloud. I think he's just gonna keep Pernicious Powdering, I hope, which then we should be fine. So I guess by old friends, they mean, they mean the bosses they know I hate. Alright, got him. That wasn't much fun. Uh, no. No. Okay, who's next? Fire Dragon God. This guy, okay. Man, and who is this Master of Spira? And then Trema. Oh my god, it's gonna make me fight Trema again. Okay, whatever. Let's go. Seems like we're dodging I've his attacks. It. It's pretty good. We're on a roll. Is Trema gonna be just like regular Trema? Is that what's gonna happen? Of course I'm fighting Trema. Of course I am. Always at your service. Well, let's pretend he's going to be just like regular Trema. So we will, um, Stamina Tonic. And then we will Mega Elixir. Okay. 
Okay. I'm gonna miss you. We got this. We're gonna beat him up. We're gonna beat him up again. We're gonna beat him up better this time. We didn't have Paragon to fight beforehand, so it's easier. Oh, you know what we could do? You know what we could do? We actually can just, like, keep going over and over. Speed up a little bit until our MP gets low. Just do it like this. Because I know what attacks I'm using until MP gets low. Oh, he got the chain! Nice! Yeah, this music's so intense. Let's see, can I do it without having to use another Mega Elixir? No, it's time for a Mega Elixir. Oh. I'm just gonna use regular elixirs because I don't I only have seven mega elixirs left. Oh meteor. Okay, well he's he's not got too much HP left if he's using meteor now. All right, let's elixir on pain. And then we'll X Potion Riku. Stop picking on Riku! What did she do to you? She's been healing this whole time. She has not messed with you. That's not true. She's been whacking him with her little too plushy. She has, she has. <gasps> I'm a liar. Okay, we're back to this. Just zoom, zoom. We got this, we got this. I can't believe this tournament makes us beat up Trema. And I guess he is on the far plane, that makes sense. Another meteor before he died. Oh, don't kill Yuna. Okay, good. Thought we were, he was about to. Okay, he's gotta be dead soon. the Ultima. I want to get high enough where I can just kill him without like him ever even doing the Ultima. Wouldn't that be nice? This'll do it! 
She said this will do it, so maybe he's almost dead? Come on. Be the last one, Pain. Oh, that would have been so cool if Riku whacking him would have been the last. <laughs> that would have been it. so cool. That little 200, 200 hit. Okay. All right, we beat it. Um, no. No. Oh, we got a Ragnarok. I guess that's the other way you can get Ragnarok. From this, this cup. Okay. Let's see, what have we got? I want to do the Far Plane Cup again because there's certain ones... This guy says there's certain ones I have to fight in the Far Plane Cup and we didn't see any of those. So I want to go into it again. Yes. Yeah, like, here we go. Like, Seymour. We need to fight Seymour. He's one of them. Okay. Let's go. You had your chance to run. Yeah, you can't sleep me. I got mascots. I got ribbons. The end. Okay, let's see. Is Seam is no. Okay, Trema knocked him out. All right. So we don't need. There's nothing here. There's no reason to beat it. So we can just run. Okay, let's try again. So there's three There's three that we're looking for here in this Far Plane Cup, okay? It's Orin, Seymour, and Titus. So that's who we're trying to find. And I saw Seymour pop up, so they definitely can pop up before I do that Almighty Shinra one. Yeah, so there he is again. There's Seymour again. So hopefully... Trema won't beat him up. Seymour, I believe in you. You can beat up Trema. Okay, you can do it. Oh, this is basically Conqueror, isn't it? This isn't really the strategy for Conqueror, considering. Yeah, stupid Megaton Press. That's why you're supposed to use Berserkers. Berserker, Berserker. But I don't know, maybe I do enough damage, and it doesn't matter. Like, how much HP does he have? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll do it like that. Yeah, I don't know. This is silly. Seymour wasn't going to beat Trema anyways. Um, okay, okay, okay. Let's enter that one more time.
Okay, so now... Okay, okay, we're good. <clears throat> yeah, we know we can beat this one with the costumes, or the mascots. Go, 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 go. There we go. Easy peasy. All right, Seymour, please do. Who is this? Oh. It's you. Um, okay. What have we got? We got Trema again. I guess I do want to fight Master of Spira. But I really want to fight Seymour. Hmm. I'm trying to think, like, what is the best way to do this? Okay. I think what we need to do is stop with the Far Plane Cup for a minute. We're going to go back to the Almighty Shinra Cup. Because I think for the, the Far Plane Cup ones... I don't need to do any leveling up, so like I can get the girls to like ni level 99. But I think that's not true for this Almighty Shinra Cup next step. So let's go ahead and do this next step. Okay, so we have to battle this cup again and defeat Almighty Shinra at the end, which we can totally do, no problems. Elephant Eater, okay. I think we can just attack on him too. It's Humbaba. I don't think we need our fancy things. I think we can just do this. Yeah, and then he's gonna Meteor. Next. Okay, here he is, Almighty Shinra. Okay, we got this. I've just been toying with you up to now. Shinra, what was that voice? What was that voice? Oh my god. And this is a brand new model. Like, they made this just for this game. Like, whoa. Okay. Um, let's bust out the big guns. Okay, we're gonna, um, where is it? Stamina Tonic. What's Stamina Tonic? And then after we Stamina Tonic, we'll get all healed up. Oh, but he's gonna do an Ultima. Cool. I love that for us. I hope Pain doesn't die, because that stamina tonic will get wasted. Oh good, she's not dead. Thank fuck. Okay, now we're gonna Mega Elixir. Wasted your turn, Shinra. You wasted your turn. Now we're definitely gonna get you. This 
should achieve the desired result. <laughs> that voice, I can't. I can't get over. What the fuck is that voice? Shinra, you don't talk like that with the weird, like, evil echo, like you're Shuyin or something. Like, what is that? You're not no Shuyin. Chill out. Prepare to meet your doom. Shinra, you don't want to doom me. All right, definitely need an X potion on Riku. Give me that. I don't know. They were they were using their lines as if he's almost dead, but he's totally not almost dead. So I don't I don't know what's, what's going on there. I guess they were just a little bit um a little bit excited. Final impact. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, Yuna lived. Uh, okay. Let's get pain back up. Oh. Okay. I could get used to this. Defeated. Allow into the gull wings. Yes. Nice. Thank you, Brain. Thank you. All right, Almighty Shinra, of course, you can join. Okay. So, apparently I'm supposed to level him up and release him, too. All right. So, organized team. Oh, he's a medium. Okay, well, we can level him up with... I don't know. I guess our chocobo can go with him. can have adamantite and let's see where is our black floor so that you can have glare oh there it is okay all right so he's at 65 so we need to get him to 70 Oh, too far. Here we go. Help readers. He just, he looks so weird with the wings and like the lizard tail. He's like a, like a, looks like a literal like demon. Shinra, why? Why is this your desire? I don't understand it. Almighty Shinra. I, wow. I just... I just wow. <laughs> I can't. Okay, let's go again. Let's go again. Yes. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. not get over that voice. That Shinra's voice should not have that effect on it. Stop! I cannot wait to finish leveling him and release him. <laughs> Shinra, come back to us. Shinra, this is not you. This, like, this is not you. This is not you, my friend. You're just a kid. You're not some kind of weird demon god. 
some kind of like Aeon looking thing. I mean, look at this. He's got bat wings. He's got a lizard tail. He's got like chicken feet. Like, what? What? Does he get a fiend tail? Like when I release him, is something gonna happen? Or is it gonna be like another like nothing? Because we didn't get a fiend tail for Paragon or Omega Weapon, right? The last fiend tail we really got was Chalk. So does Almighty Shinra get one? And Brain, can you correct me if I'm wrong? I think at this point I'm safe to get YRP up to level 99. Like there's no other like level up fiend tails after Almighty Shinra, right? Like the other ones that I have to get, it's just some humans. So I would just get them and release them. Am I understanding that right, Brain? Like I could blitz them up the levels and it'd be all good at this point. Yeah, I think Shinra is the last. Okay, that's what I think too, looking at like the notes that I wrote from this guide. I can't believe I talked over him. He did the, mm, mm, but with the weird, F oh my God, Shinra. Stop it. I just, I can't, I can't this is ridiculous. And like when he enters battle and he's like, <sighs> Like, he's so tired. Like, Shinra, I know you're tired. You don't need to do this. All right, two more levels on him, and then we can release him. Release him from this misery. Turn him back into real Shinra. The animations on him are really cool though, I'm not gonna lie, like, I wish this model was used somewhere else as well, because it's neat looking. Like, it's really neat. And like, clearly these fiend tails were like super important because they made a whole new model for the end boss of them. Like, that's amazing. There he goes again! What? Okay. Come on. We're almost, we're almost there. Just two more levels. I think he's gonna get 69 on this fight. This fight. Oh no, not quite. Okay. Next fight. That move's pretty cool too. Try that's like a unique animation. Years. Like that's a really unique animation too. Like that that move doesn't exist anywhere else in 10 or 10 2. So a unique move as well. All right, one more level. Should maybe be like three or four more battles of these guys, and then we can release him and see what happens.
Boom. Boom, boom, boom. All right, 70. Okay. We can go release him now. Release him from his misery. Poor Shinra. Okay. Let's save him. All right. I play for keeps. It's just too much. Okay. Oh, I here's play the story. For keeps. <coughs> oh, I had to sneeze. Okay. Anyways, let's find out. Okay. Analysis failed. Data is protected. Analyze me. Try in another one thousand years. I play for keeps. Analysis failed. Data is protected. Analyze me. Try in another one hundred years. I play for keeps. Analysis failed. Data is protected. Analyze me. Try in another ten years. I play for keeps. Analysis failed. Data is protected. Anna. I play for keeps. And what? Anna, what? And a what, Shinra? Shinra? Oh, oh, Shinra, Shinra's still there. I see him. I got really nervous for a second. Huh? Episode complete. You scored the last resort garment grid. Okay. Um, let's see what the last resort garment grid does. That was one we didn't have. Um, oh my god. Uh, okay. MP cost is zero. Always crit. Magic boost. Break. Damage limit. Hidden hero drink. So it doesn't do anything by itself, but the... Oh. Oh, you have to... Oh, that's weird. That's a weird configuration. Huh. Okay. All right. Hmm. My last mission with the Goldwings. Shinra, it, it, it sounds different whenever, like, you were just, like, a weird god fiend. Okay, a second ago. It just, it's... It, the words hit a little different now. I'm just saying. Um, yeah. Okay. Whew. Okay. Um, so we've got one, two, three, four. Yeah, so there's Almighty Shinra. My god. Okay, so there's only four. Excuse me. Oh, there's only four left. I gotta chill. Um, okay, so to get the last four, we have to keep beating the Far Plane Cup until certain we get certain ones. Okay. So I think to do that... I really want to level the girls a lot more um, to make it easy. So let me take a second to think about how I want to do it. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back while we think about that. Y'all can listen to the nice music for a second. Give me just just like two seconds. Okay, we're back. We're back, you guys. All right. Let me go look at my garment grids. 
skill, we're gonna start from the bottom. So there's Covenant of Growth, but you have to pass the things to get it to do anything. It doesn't just do it on equip. Okay. I think we want to keep do using higher power. I think we want to use higher power. Yeah. Okay, why did I navigate away from that screen? I have no idea. I'm crazy. Okay, and then let's put Lady Luck on there. Let's put Thief on there. Um. Songstress. Let's see what else. Oh, we can definitely put Gun Mage on there. And then I guess. And then Warrior. Alright, so Yuna's gonna level up Songstress. Riku is gonna be leveling up Thief. Pain is also gonna be leveling up Thief. Okay. Oh, wait, no. Uh, I think I want them all on Lady Luck. Well, let's see who, who still needs Lady Luck abilities. Let's see, who didn't ever finish it? Yuna finished it. Riku did not. And Pain did not. Okay, well, Riku and Pain can equip Lady Luck then and finish those abilities. And then... Yuna can have, let's see, key to success, so that's going to double all, and then she can have AP egg, do I have anything else that like makes leveling faster, I don't think I do. I think that's all that I have for that. I can put a ribbon on her. Yeah, we can do that. Okay. And we are gonna go level in my favorite leveling spot. I'm gonna show this to y'all and I'm gonna I'm gonna end up doing most of this leveling off stream I think but I want to show y'all where this is in case anyone is forgotten from last time so we're gonna turn off encounters while we walk over there oh not superpower there we go okay so basically at the end of the game in my opinion this is the best leveling spot for just getting like lots of um, encounters really fast that are pretty simple and give decent experience. I'm gonna save on the way there, just in case. Alright, where are they at on their abilities? Just to make sure I've got them learning good ones. Okay, she's learning the last songstress. Um, oh, she's on four dice. Let's get a cheaper one. Let's do magic reels. Yeah, let's do a cheaper one. So you can make some progress. Okay, so talk to this guy. And we're gonna go in the hole. Gonna go down to hole. Okay. We're not actually trying to, like, um, do the puzzle. 
I'm really just fighting mobs. We've done the puzzle before, we've done it multiple times. You can find that in my first playthrough. If you go to my Final Fantasy X-2 um, playlist, you can find um, how to do this puzzle in like the, the first set of thumbnails where I'm doing my, my initial playthrough. It is, there is like a, it's like a math thing. There's like a trick to it. It's not hard once you understand it, but you have to take notes as you're doing it or it doesn't work. <laughs> uh, you can't just do it. Okay, let's see how many levels we can get in like the next 20 minutes. And how many skills too. See if we can level up some dress spheres. Get it, girls. And then this will make it really simple to do the last couple things we need to do. And we'll be super OP. See, they're already leveling pretty fast. Because those Lady Lux are really useful with that. And it's no problem to kill these things. Very easy. Even without Iron Dukes, like, they die really fast. Alright, we can learn Magic Reels. Let's go take a look. Okay. Oh, Item Reels. Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to kind of learn them from like whatever's the cheapest, you know, just so that it makes her, makes her go a little bit faster. Zoom, zoom. Get them, girls. Bum, bum, ba -na 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 -bum. Yeah, see, Lady Luck is making Pain and Riku go speedy, speedy. Even with the keys to success on Yuna. lady you back for attentions you can come up here say hi to everybody you want to come here come here so i can pet you easier it's like really hard to reach down there which i know you don't understand because you're a kitty cat oh look at you you're gonna go down yep you can go down so good Meow. Come here. Come on up here. Item reels. Yay. Meow. Okay. I have to reach down there. Do I? Do I have to reach down there? Everybody, y'all want to see Lady? Lady. Oh, Lady. You want some attention? There she is. She does know it. I'm so happy then. Okay, you can jump down now if you want to. There you go. <laughs> she doesn't mind being picked up, but it's not her favorite. She'll just tolerate it for a bit if she's getting what she wants. Yeah, that's one of my kitties. That's Lady. Um, if you do, uh, I think it's, yeah, if you subscribe to my channel, the subscriber badges is, um, is her with little dragon wings. 
Um, because that's her little, her was her baby name. She, they were, we accidentally fostered a litter of kittens at one point, and uh, they, we gave them all baby names because, like, we were gonna give most of them away, you know? So we just gave them names to call them by, and Lady's baby name was Dragon. Because, um, when she was really small, the little swirly patterns on her fur kind of looked like a little sitting dragon. And now there's cat fur all over my face. <laughs> it's what I deserve for doing that to her. Uh, okay, I think Yuna just learned the last songstress ability. Yes, she did. Okay, I think I want to have her um, level white mage next. I think that would be good. Okay, let's go to the garment grid that we're using. And let's put white mage in that spot. Okay, yeah, that's all fine. She can just start with Vigor. Okay, let's go. Too bad white mages can't attack and they just pray. But it's fine, she'll just pray over and over. Can't hurt, can only help. Now Pain learned magic reels. Okay. Abilities. Let's go down and get Asuna for her. Where's Riku at? Oh wow, she's on a oh but she's already halfway through. It's fine, I just leave her there. Item reels, okay, that's all good. Yeah, I think we're just gonna, I'm just gonna get everybody up to the 90s so that like this is simple and we can kill Trema really fast because clearly we have to beat Trema over and over in that far plane cup. Like that is gonna be a thing and it's gonna just use so many items if I'm not high level. I wonder what'll happen first, if I'll finish up the skills on these Lady Luck Dress Spheres for Riku and Pain, or if I'll get level 99 first. I feel like at this rate I'm going, I'll get level 99 first, you know? Oh, she got random reels. I don't know. Well, I put the AP egg on Riku, so maybe not. Let's see, where are you at, Riku? Okay, she's just down to four dice. And then the last skill. Okay, so maybe she'll finish Lady Luck first. Alright, Dispel. That's a spell I never use. I just use Dispel Tonics. I never use the actual Dispel spell in this game, ever. I don't think I've used it a single time. I was like, why when you have Tonics? After life. Yeah. <laughs> oh, full life. Uh, let's get shell first. Full life is really expensive. Mm 
Yeah, Riku's speeding along there. So she's about to learn whatever the last Lady Luck thing is. Then I guess I can put the AP egg on Pain so she can speed up the Lady Luck skill bonus. Get them, girls. Shell, and then what? Okay, protect, sure. Oh, SOS Spell Spring? Really? That's what you get at the end? I don't remember that. But that was her last one. Okay. All right, sweet. Okay, so instead of Lady Luck, let's put her back on Thief. And then we're gonna remove the AP egg. We're gonna give Pain the AP egg. Where is it? Okay, she can have a ribbon instead. Ribbon, ribbon. There's a ribbon. Okay, so we've got White Mage, Thief, Lady Luck. Okay, and she's just moving along. So Pain's gonna end up, because like, she's higher level and I'm keeping her on the, on freaking Lady Luck, like she's gonna hit 99 and the other girls aren't gonna be there yet, but that's okay. It's just more, more level ups for the um, skills. I guess I should have given the AP egg to pain. But that's okay. Riku is almost done with Thief, I think, too. Right? She just got one more? Yeah, she's got just this one more, and it only needs 20 points. We're gonna finish up Thief for her. You know, I don't think I've ever played this game enough where I finished up Thief for Riku. It takes so many points. And then I, you know, and I switch her over to Alchemist, so it just like never happens. Thief is so OP though, like with its you know, two shots, so it like uh, combos itself. You get all the chains when you have lots of thieves. magic level two. Okay, yeah, you can do that. Steel will. That Wait, that was the last thief one. Oh my gosh, that was the last thief one. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so Riku's finished with thief. Wow, 
I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Okay. Um, let's put her on warrior. Yeah, she can be on warrior. There you go. <coughs> What's so cool about Riku with the sword ones is she uses orange swords, um, which is so funny. It's like, you know, in Final Fantasy X, Orin is like who's dragging Titus along on his journey. Right? And in 10-2, uh, Riku spends a lot of time being nervous that she's dragging Yuna along. So I love that parallel. I think it's so much fun that they do that and have uh, Riku be have Orin swords in kind of like an Orin-esque role in some ways. And there's a lot different between Riku's and uh, Orin's role, but in in that in that feeling they match. And that's shown with the swords. Oh, we can get S okay. You get SOS spell spring just from four dice. Okay, I understand. We're going to go ahead and learn it because it's cheap. Yeah, I think if I get all the way up to level 99 and I use mascots and stuff, I can beat Trema without running out of um, MP. And then that would be the ideal situation. For getting the last fiends from the Far Plane Cup. We're almost going to get into the 80s. You level up fast this way. And doing the times two speed does not hurt. Pain is 80. Damn, just one hit from the warrior sword. That's all it takes for him now. That's awesome.
All right. Was that Kira? Yeah. So Kiraga. Okay. All right, you guys. I am going to finish this leveling off stream. Okay. So if you are here watching the recorded version of this on the YouTubes, thank you so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe uh, down below. And uh, of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.